Hey everyone, it's me Chrissy. This is going to be my answer video to the question and answers video that I posted last week. Um, I got a lot of questions so I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, my first question was, I'm looking at my computer right now, that's why I'm looking away from the camera. How do you do a smoky purple eye without making it look like you got punched? Uh, that's a very good question. Um, what I would do is I would do something like Satellite Dreams on the lid with Purple Haze Matte Eyeshadow in the crease. As a highlight, I would use Vapor. And um, I would try not to put any kind of shadows on the lower lid. Try not to make that look like purple. Um, I would just keep the focus of the purple on the eyelid. I wouldn't bring it down here on the lower lash line. That's what I would do. Um, what is your favorite mascara? Okay, I really like the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. I think it's amazing for a drugstore brand. But I really do get that out of my makeup bag. I'm really loving the... Um, how do you say this? I think it's the Yves Saint Laurent um, Mascara looks like that and it works amazing um, I have it on my eyelashes they really it really makes my eyelashes look very volumized and lengthened um, my favorite nail polish China Glaze Spontaneous is this really pretty um, purple it's what I have on my nails but they're chipped right now so they look kind of crappy um, favorite drugstore brush I don't have a lot of drugstore brushes but I love the Michael Craft Store's Maxine Mop, and they're cheaper than Drugstore, and they're very comparable to the Max 239, and they're about $3. Next question, how do you make eyeshadows appear more visible on camera? Definitely use a base. Um, I really love Painterly Paint Pot from MAC. It's just really creamy base. You can use something like L'Oreal Decrease or um, Urban Decay Primer Potion. Just something that's pretty sticky that will adhere to your eyeshadows. In middle school and high school, did you play any sports? Yes, um, in high school and middle school I played softball. I did um, recreation softball, travel softball, and also high school softball eyeliner do you use for your waterline? I actually don't use um, eyeliner on my waterline. I do not like black liner on my waterline. It looks amazing on other people, but I feel like it really makes my eyes smaller. And um, if you do see me use a liner on my waterline, it would definitely be a white liner um, to make my eyes appear bigger and brighter. So no, I don't use black eyeliner on my waterline. Next question, how long did it take you to reach as many subscribers as you have? Um, well, I started making videos a few months ago. I think my first actual makeup tutorial was only two and a half months ago. So I mean, it took me a couple months. Okay, what is the best quality drugstore brand eyeshadow? I really love Revlon um, makeup. I think that brand is amazing. Um, and I also like the L'Oreal Hip eyeshadows. Those are really good. Next question. How do you get your lips looking so moisturized? Hmm, okay. I, before I put on lipstick or anything like that, I use a... Burt's Bees lip balm. Another thing you can do is get like a, a raggedy old toothbrush and put a little bit of petroleum jelly on it and just run it over your lips to get the dead skin off just for a couple minutes and it really makes your lips really soft. Favorite lip gloss. Hands down, Ninfet lip gloss from MAC. It's just a gorgeous goldy pink color. It was one of my first ones, and that's why it is so close to my heart. Um, favorite perfume, it's a toss-up between two. The Harajuku Lovers in G, or the Coco Chanel Mademoiselle. 
though and I look I only have a little bit left of that and those are my two favorite scents okay favorite eyeshadow this is a hard question I love all my eyeshadows it's going to be really boring, but I'm in love with my highlight color, Malar or Mylar. It's a really pretty satiny white color. It's very boring, but I use it almost every day. Especially when I do a neutral eye like this. Um, most of the time, because I work for a dentist, he, um, not he, I don't really wear crazy colors on my eyelids. I always wear makeup, but um, I always do like a more neutral eye. Okay. Best store bought like teeth whitener. Oh, I gotta show you guys something so funny. Be right back. <laughs> okay. First, I would have to say that the best one would be those Crest White Strips. I've used them and they work really good. So, I work for a dentist and we took models of our teeth yesterday and these are the, my teeth models. Look how pretty. Hi, YouTube. Hello. <laughs> Worst makeup product that I've ever tried. Oh, my goodness. The, I believe it was the L'Oreal Mineralized um, Powder Foundation. <sighs> it comes with the brush, like, in the um, the container, and you take off the container, and you, you screw it off, and then you dip the brush, and then you put it all over your face. I woke up the next day with little bumps all over my face, my forehead, my neck, everywhere. Um, I had an allergic reaction to the mineral makeup. So I tend not to use anything with mineralized like foundation. I'm very scared. Because I don't want little bumps on my face. Okay. <laughs> what is your favorite drugstore product? Okay. If you saw my last video, um, you guys know how much I love the Revlon Colorstay foundation. Um, like I said in my other video, I think it's a lot better than the Max um, Studio Fix Fluid. I mean, I still, I still love this foundation, but I feel like this one stays on all day, and it's a little bit better color that matches my skin tone. So I would definitely have to say the color, um, the Colorstay foundation by Revlon. Okay, what is your favorite face moisturizer? Definitely Philosophy's Hope in a Jar. That is an amazing um, moisturizer. Okay, what is the best drugstore mascara? Hands down, the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. Amazing. Or I also like the um, Lash Stylist by Maybelline. Okay, next question. Are there days that you hate your makeup and just want to go naked on your face? Um, I love makeup. Uh, I do it every day, but yes, sometimes you just want to not do it and just leave the house, which that never happens, but yeah. Not that I hate makeup or that I would ever hate makeup. It's just sometimes you just want to get up and go and makeup kind of holds you back. <laughs> okay. Do you have those days where your makeup doesn't go on properly and you feel caked on? Am I the only one? No, you are not the only one. Yes, there are days where I put a little bit too much makeup on and yes, I do feel a little caked. <laughs> How much drugstore makeup do you have other than the NYX Jumbo Pencils? Well, I do have some drugstore makeup. Um... I like Revlon. I have, by the way, um, I've been trying this Revlon foundation primer. I believe Court, Co uh, Court Cosmetics recommended this in one of her videos, and it really is amazing. I've been using this together with the Colorstay foundation. Did you go to college? Which one? And what do you want to do when you grow up? I went to a dental um, CDA program school for dental assisting and what I'm doing now is I am a surgical assistant for an oral surgeon. We do surgery in the mouth and that is what I plan to do when I grow up. I mean I'm going to be 25 in July so I guess I'm a grown up. <laughs> what is your favorite drugstore brand? Revlon. What is your favorite drugstore foundation? 
I was just talking about that. The Revlon Color Stay Foundation is amazing. You should definitely try it. Do you wear makeup every day or just when you go out? Um, no, I wear makeup every day. I don't leave the house without makeup. Your favorite MAC blush would definitely have to be True Romance. Or... Well, no, that's my favorite one. <laughs> favorite MAC lipstick. Snob or you? H-U-E. Not you. You. H-U-E. Uh, if you had to bring one thing on an island, what would it be? My boyfriend. <laughs>